second day of Together for Europe and we are here with Sister Nicole. Could you say something about this morning? It was about hope and Europe, no? Yeah, it was about hope in Europe and actually it was about the question how and we as movements and communities could give some hope to Europe. So we figured out what the political situation is or the social situation and then we said, okay, there's something we actually can give into this situation, um, a present we can give. And although hope is not very political or whatever, but nevertheless, it's a basic thing that sort of encourages um, living together and working together and even reconciliation. So that's apparently what we can give and I'm very, very happy with this morning because everybody sort of felt the spirit and said, yeah, yeah, I want to be part of this hope-giving mission and that is something I really enjoyed, although we do not deny what the actual situation in Europe is. We, I, I think we clearly see that, um, but I also think that we as communities and movements do have an answer. So, Sister Nicole, when did it start your commitment in Together for Europe and why? Actually, it started in Munich, when we were in Munich 2010. Um, and I was sent from my community and I thought, mm, funny people there. Well, okay, I'm doing the organization stuff and so on. But then it's sort of, yeah, I can only say it just started. I got into contact with other people and I found out, oh, that is very rich and we are all on the move together. And I really enjoyed it and it was much more than enjoyment. It was like I got the feeling that we all were called um, to be together and to walk on together and to, to walk this way we are actually walking right now, although we don't know where it ends at the end. Um, but we do it and we do it together and we learn from one each other and what that was very very impressive and then I got sort of addicted so I can't leave. A last question, what do you think Christian movements can offer to Europe today? They can offer an idea of unity. I'm really, really sure that they can do this and they can offer it not only by speeches um, but by living. And that is something I really, really like. And that is also the task for us as communities uh, to be sure about this task and to live it every, every day. And um, there, I guess, we do have a great gift to give. Thank you very much, Sister Nicole, and uh, best wishes for this afternoon. Thank you. <laughs>